future perfect tense. Let us now study about the structure of sentence for future perfect tense. Let us take the case of a positive sentence. The structure of the sentence will be subject plus auxiliary verb plus main verb or past participle plus object that is subject plus will have plus third form of verb or past participle plus object. For example, she will have finished the work by Wednesday. Here, she is the subject, will have is the auxiliary verb and finished is the past participle form of the verb. You will have started a job. Here, you is the subject. Will have is the auxiliary verb. And started is the past participle form of the verb. Let us now take the case of a negative sentence. The structure will be Subject plus not between auxiliary verbs plus main verb or past participle plus object that is subject plus will not have plus third form of verb or past participle plus object for example she will not have finished the work by Wednesday here she is the subject will not have is the auxiliary verb and finished is the past participle form of the verb. You will not have started a job. Here, you is the subject. Will not have is the auxiliary verb. And started is the past participle form of the verb. Let us now take the case of a negative sentence. The structure will be Auxiliary verb plus subject plus auxiliary verb plus main verb or past participle plus object. That is, will plus subject plus have plus third form of verb or past participle plus object. Let us take some examples. Will she have finished the work by Wednesday? Here, will is the auxiliary verb. She is the subject and finished is the past participle form of the verb. Will you have started a job? Here, will is the auxiliary verb. You is the subject. Started is the past participle form of the verb. Here are some more examples of sentences in the future perfect tense. She will have decorated her home. I will have bought a computer. Will he have finished his work? They will not have shifted to a new home. Will you have made a new chair? Students will not have passed the examination.